Visiting Tibetan deputies of the National People's Congress have held a seminar with representatives of overseas Chinese societies and intellectuals in New York City. During Thursday's seminar, members of the delegation briefed the representatives on the real situation in Tibet. The five-member delegation was led by Shing Sata Zindrajak, a living Buddha. He's also vice chairman of the Standing Committee of the People's Congress of the Tibet Autonomous Region. He has witnessed Tibet's history before and after liberation. He briefed the representatives on the real situation and huge developments achieved since 1959 using detailed statistics. He also stressed that freedom of religious beliefs is well protected in Tibet, different religions and sects coexist and flourish in the region. The delegation's briefing received a warm welcome from the overseas Chinese representatives. I think the introduction by the delegation is very good. It can help us to clear up the misunderstanding of Westerners on the Tibetan issue. The delegation's U.S. visit came after a recent attack on China by the Dalai Lama. On March the 10th, the Dalai Lama said the religion, culture, language and identity of Tibetans was near extinction. Amy Bainbridge, CCTV.